Okay, so in this video, we're going to prove by induction that if a is 1, 0, minus 1, 2, this matrix, then a to the n is 1, 0, 1 take away 2 to the n, 2 to the n. Okay, so step 1, prove true for n equals 1. So a to the 1 is equal to 1, 0, 1 take away 2 to the 1, 2 to the 1. And that leaves us as 1, 0, negative 1, 2, which is the matrix A. So that's done. Step, true, step 2, rather, uh, assume true for n equals k. So a to the k is equal to 1, 0, 1, take away 2 to the k, 2 to the k. Step 3. Prove true for n is equal to k plus 1. Okay, so a to the power of k plus 1 must be equal to a to the k times by a to the 1. Now, a to the k, remember, is this. So we have 1, 0, 1, take away 2 to the k, 2 to the k. And we're going to multiply that by the matrix A, which is 1, 0, minus 1, 2. OK. So we've got 1, 0, multiplying with 1, minus 1. So that gets us 1. We've got 1, 0, multiplying with 0, 2, which is going to get us 0. We've got 1 minus 2k, 1 minus 2 to the k, 2 to the k, multiplied by the 1 minus 1. So 1 minus 2 to the k times 1, and then 2 to the k times minus 1. And then we've got the bottom row multiplied by the final column. So that times that is 0, 2 to the k times 2, so 2 lots of 2 to the k. So we have 1. Then 1 take away 2 lots of 2 to the k, because we've got minus 2 to the k, take away 2 to the k, so we've got 2 lots of 2 to the k there. 0, 2 lots of 2 to the k. So we've got 1. Now, 2 to the 1 times 2 to the k is 2 to the k plus 1, so 1 take away 2 to the k plus 1. We've got 2 to the k plus 1 there as well, 0. OK. So you can see that if I just replaced n with k plus 1 up here, I would have got precisely this. So this is in the correct format as I wanted. So as it was true for n is equal to 1, and if true for n equals k, then it is true for n equals k plus 1. So that's what we proved. So it is true for all n greater than or equal to 1. Okay, and so that is our proof.